Hi everybody, welcome to GT Coding. In this tutorial series, we are creating this website using Next.js. Now in this video, we will just set up our project. So let's get started. Now here I have created this folder called Tech News and I just opened it with VS Code. Now let's go ahead and open the terminal. So you can just go over here to View and click on Terminal. And here we have the terminal. So let's go ahead and start by writing the command npx create next app at latest and we'll just add a dot over here to create it in the current directory so this command will create a new next app so let's enter and we need to proceed so let's press enter and here we have some questions so let's answer this the first one is do you like to use typescript so i'll just select yes and yes for eslint and yes for tailwind css and no for source directory and yes for the app router and no for customizing the import alias right now the app is being created right our next app has been created and uh, you can open the app by just typing npm run dev and here we can see our app is opened in localhost 3001 so let's open it and this is how our app looks and this is the default design of the home page of a new Next.js app. Now let's go ahead and uh, remove all of this and uh, let's go over here to the app folder and let's go to the page.tsx file. So this is where all this design is coming from. So let's go ahead and delete all of this and I'll just add a simple h1 and uh, I'll just type hello. And let's save this and let's go back and now we can see it says hello and we also have this uh, global css styles added so let's go to the global.css file and uh, i'll just delete all of this except these tailwind styles so i'll just delete all of these and uh, now let's go back and now we can see that we don't have any styles added we just have hello displayed right now let's go back to our project and uh, this is how the project is structured we have this main page.tsx file and uh, this is the main page of our application and uh, then we have this file called layout.tsx and here we can add the design that should be displayed on all the pages so if we add something over here so for example if i go over here to this body and uh, here if i just add for example header and now if we go back here we can see that header is displayed so whenever we want to add any layout or things like header or footer, you can add it over here inside the layout.tsx file. So I'll just delete it for now. And then we have this global.css file where we can add the global CSS. And then we have this uh, public folder where we can add our images. And uh, then we have these other files. So this is basically how our project is structured. So let's go over here outside our app directory and let's create a new folder called components. And in this, we'll create all the components like the header, footer, the post component, and all those things over here. So we'll create all the components and add it inside this components folder. All right, so that's basically it with the setup of our application. And from the next video, we will start designing this project. So that's it for this video. If you have any doubts, you can ask in the comments below. And if you like this video, please click on the like button and subscribe to this channel to get the latest video updates. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a nice day.